that's what you're going forward with. Yeah, I mean, it's just the way numbers work out sometimes. Um, you know, just is what it is. Tim, you mentioned Ronald uh, coming back. How do you think he held up? How do you think he performed? And having Jalen the week before with those guys, did, did they give you that much more confidence to do some different things? Yeah, I mean, we didn't give them a whole lot of help outside. We were giving help to inside, and even though sometimes it didn't look like it, we were putting a lot of attention on the quarterback for those scrambles because he was a hard guy to get down on the ground. Um, you know, the only help the corners really had was Mother Nature in that game. But they um, they both battled and not only, um, you know, not only able, enabled us to play the rest of that scheme, but I thought they did a good job tackling and, and limiting some uh, some plays after that. We were able to pick up some stops along the way and keep scoring out. Yeah, about the importance of uh, playing the lead for the offense, Where, how did it affect you guys uh, uh, having the team play ahead? Yeah, I mean, I think that the, there was a couple turning points that way. I think it was 7-3 to three late in the second quarter. We were down in that game. And uh, we were able to get that turnover, and the offense was able to turn that into points. I think it's time we made two more. Yes, it was. We never get a chance to watch. But um, but that's a big difference going 7-3 seven to, seven to three at the end of the first half, being down as opposed to being up. Yeah, eight, whatever. We have, whatever. And I guess I'm, I'm not bad on that right now. But, um, you know, I thought that was, you know, that, that was, and, and that's something that, you know, you, you haven't seen a lot from our team this year, you know, that when we have been successful, you know, defense has made a turnover, the offense has cashed it in, and a lot of times that's changed the game. And I think on the other side of that, one of the things I saw that I, you know, there's a lot of things that were sort of turning points in that game, but the other one was after we had fumbled the punt, we just got to stop, and all of a sudden, I think it was a one-score game at that point, and, um, you know, they got the ball, we were able to go get get a stop and force a punt right there. And that's something we haven't seen from our defense a lot. You know, you go back to the Dallas game, we turned it over a couple times and we gave them quick touchdowns. Um, you know, this is a good sign for us going forward. We went out and we were able to, you know, get the job done. It doesn't always happen, but we were able to get the job done, uh, force, a, force a punt right there. And I think um, I think we scored right after that. That ended up getting into it. Once you really got that game into a two-score game, the way the wind was and everything else, um, it obviously made it a lot easier to be able to handle a lot of that stuff. You know, when it's one score, you know, one guy slipping and falling on a wet field, or one ball over your head, or one missed tackle, or one missed assignment, and all of a sudden you can talk about a tie game. So it was important to get that two score lead right there in order to hold that one score lead. And um, I think you saw that, and I think that's a good sign for our team. Well,